hey hi friends welcome back to the our channel if you not subscribe then please subscribe and hit this bell icon to get notification first after the few months ago i will publish this one video related to the saw esp32 s3 module i mean i will explain how you use this directly to arduino id software through okay i will publish this article related to the saw esp32 s3 module if you not see then please go through and see first and then you come back to this video and then you do this project okay now see the circuit diagram of our project this one is the circuit diagram and here i just use this esp32 s3 module and the l293 motor driver will be connected to this directory in1 to this d5 sorry in1 to this d6 in2 d5 and in3 is d8 in Four is D10 and VCC will be connected to this 5 volt and ground will be connected to this ground. Do this proper connection and then you go to this output side of this L293 motor driver. And here I use this N20 motors. If you want, then you use this BU motor also. Just positive or negative, do this connection properly and come to this power supply. Here I use this 3.7 volt lithium iron battery. I will we use these two cells and the positive will be connected to this positive side and the negative will be connected to this negative i mean this vcc and ground this one is the final circuit diagram and if you want then please check out this video description okay let's see this code i will explain how to install this board in arduino id software first open this arduino id software then go to this setting and just copy and paste this link the link available in this video description if you want then please check out just press this ok button go to this tools go to this board and board manager and you type this esp32 model and you see the esp32 model will be not installed if you go to this tools and check this board is the esp32 is not available just you click this install button and after the few seconds the board will be installed in your ID, you know, ID software. When the processing will be done just go to this tools. Go to this board and you see this ESP32 model will be come. In this few step you directly install this ESP32 model. Just select this proper board and hit this uploading button. Okay, let's see this hardware. In this hardware, I use this small chassis, and in back side, I attach these two view motors, one crystal wheels, and this one is the battery section. I use this two two lithium iron battery. In this top side, I use this L two nine three D motor driver, and I will attach these two motors and two external power supply. This one is the on and off button. You directly on and off this robot with the help of the sliding switch now here i just connected this esp32 s3 model we use this small cut of this zero pcb and female header now i will attach it and i will give in this external power supply is this 3.7 volt lithium ion battery through okay now the hardware will be completed the code will be copy and paste it the code available in this website if you want then please check out just copy i mean this uh, put your wi-fi and password name properly and here is this pin definition of this esp32 s3 model camera module and the led pin will be connected to number 21 and the l293 d motor driver will be connected like this in the wide setup i will defining all this input and output devices uh, upload this uh, code just you go to this board and select this esp32 model and just scroll down and in this downside is, is how esp32 s3 model will be available and this board will be available just you select this board just you select this board so esp32 s3 model and go to this tool select this proper board and just psrm will be enable it okay and hit this uploading button now you see this uploading will be in process
when uploading will be done you just press this reset button and open this serial monitor to receive this one url i mean this local ip address just copy it and paste any web browser let's see this working of this project you just copy this url and paste it in your tab and you just see this web dashboard is the small camera i mean this video stream video available available and is the five buttons available forward backward right and left and stop when you clicking this forward backward right and left the robot will be rotate in like direction if i click this forward the robot will go into this forward backward is the robot will come to this backward when i clicking this left button the robot will be rotate in this left and like at this right okay if you have any doubt then please comment below i will try to solve your doubts and if you if you like this project please hit the like button share with all the friends if you new in my youtube channel please subscribe and press the bell icon to get notification first thank you for watching have a nice day